performance cannot ever be a single dimension. It has to have multiple dimensions for it to be comprehensible. And so the principle of a dashboard or scorecard is that uh, all performance measures for, for it to be credible has to have two, three, four measures or, or groups of measures, I should say, um, uh, gauges, if you can imagine a dashboard, it has to have multiple gauges. Uh, one of them may be financial, one of them may be uh, related to mission achievement or social impact, but there are other ones that are possible like quality and operational excellence, and also you can imagine customer satisfaction as another possible gauge. We're going to nominate some of these possible uh, metrics and we're going to suggest that across an organization to manage effectively, you need to have multiple uh, gauges, multiple uh, meters of, uh, of effectiveness, uh, and that just looking at finance or just looking at social uh, impact is not enough. And so the whole premise of the scorecard or um, dashboard approach is to say we have to redirect our attention towards the idea that there's not one single holy grail of, uh, of social return on investment. Some, monetized magic number that's going to tell the whole story, but instead we need a mixed uh, approach that's going to look at a, at, at, at a series of metrics grouped into, into a small number of critical baskets. And so that's what we will advance. And that, that goes back to this idea also that, you know, that this financial model has to be understood in the broader context of organizational excellence, that you can't pull the financial side of a nonprofit out and say we're maximizing, we're just going to manage the financial bottom line. The financial bottom line, of course, is deeply intertwined with the, uh, with the other perspective, the customer perspective, the quality perspective, uh, and the social impact perspective.